I'm Sanjeeva Srivastava, Professor in the Department of Biosciences and Bioengineering, Indian Institute of Technology, Bombay. My laboratory works primarily on clinical proteomics, where we try to address different challenging biological problems, especially in cancer and a few infectious diseases. In terms of cancer, we work on brain tumors and also the highly prevalent cancers in India, such as breast cancer, cervical and oral cancer. We also work on infectious diseases, especially on febrile infection like malaria, dengue and more recently on COVID-19. The aim is to look at the entire complex proteome or metabolome and identify some of the biomarkers of interest using high resolution mass spectrometry based omics analysis. First of all, we want to investigate the proteome from the tissue sample or body fluids like plasma, saliva, urine and various biological samples. The first aim is to investigate which are all the proteins present in these biological samples. We utilize high resolution hybrid and tribrid orbitrap LC-MSMS platforms with inbuilt principle such as CID, HCD, ETD and ETHCD. The Orbitraf Fusion Tribrid Mass Spectrometer provides very high resolution, accurate mass measurement, wide dynamic range, excellent sensitivity and ready to achieve selectivity and advanced fragmentation options to separate these complex proteins and uses them to different type of chromatography methods to optimize the gradients and utilize a different type of collision cell. And we try to get as many proteins as possible from these samples. Additionally, the problem in understanding the metabolites when investigation of metabolomics is very crucial. For that also, we utilize Orbitrap configuration and use the Q-executive mass spectrometer coupled to ultimate 3000 UHPLC. Aim is to look at different ways of separating the metabolites and how well one could understand the metabolomic changes happening in the patient samples. Primarily, if you look into the COVID-19 or malaria sample, there's a lot of interest in the plasma metabolomics analysis. After we perform the deep proteome analysis or the metabolomics analysis, finally it comes to validation of the target. Validation of biomarkers requires several types of antibody-based tests. However, due to the lack and availability of antibody, many labs are utilizing triple quadrupole TSQR test mass spectrometer coupled to a Vanquish UHPLC system for biomarker validation and use MRM or SRM assays to validate the target. Therefore, we utilize HPLC coupled with triple quadrupole MS to develop the MRM assays. Here we make sure that entire assay becomes more quantitative. Therefore, we first start with identification of set of peptides to develop their transitions and run in the skyline based analysis. After the preliminary analysis, we short test the peptides of interest and then we try to develop the heavy labeled synthetic peptides which can be utilized for the more quantitative analysis. So any biomolecular discovery program from diagnostic to looking at prognostics and therapeutic value requires extensive type of discovery as well as validation work and it cannot be achieved by just one platform. Therefore, we are very much open to utilizing different type of technologies, different platforms and mass spectrometers. We also utilize microarrays, surface plasmon resonance and other assays to validate our biomarkers. I hope our efforts as well as several leading researchers from India who are contributing towards biomarker discovery program will enable the path for new biomarkers to come to the clinics.